A Los Alamos native traded in the mountains for a beach, but now her family's life is in shambles because of Hurricane Irma. News 13's Brittany Bage shows us how her friends here are trying to help out. Hurricane Irma hit the U.S. Virgin Islands as a Category 5 storm, leveling everything in its path, including Los Alamos native and Army veteran Deja Jaramillo's new home. Their house sustained a lot of damage. After 14 years as a paratrooper in the Army, Jaramillo made St. Thomas her growing family's home. They didn't have time to evacuate the island, so they rode out the storm in a bunker. Just the fact that she's got two small children and a newborn is... It was just awful knowing that she was going through it. Amanda Tyler grew up in Los Alamos with Deja. She and another friend, Christina Sullivan, say the Jamarillo spent 10 hours waiting for the storm to pass. She said it was really loud, really scary. And emerged to find their home and everything around it destroyed. Her little girl's room is completely gone. Her little boy's room has a huge gaping hole in one of the walls. They've had to leave the house. Tonight, this family will sleep at a hotel in Puerto Rico, unsure of their next move. So, longtime friends stepped in to help. Um, I started the GoFundMe for Deja because I've known her since elementary school, and after seeing the destruction out there, um, just thought that she was going to need a lot of help. Help to rebuild or help to move on. Sullivan says the family may be forced to leave their island home forever. I can't imagine have being in a family of five and having your home completely lost. Brittany Bade, KRQE News 13. And we have a link to that GoFundMe page on our website, krqe.com. Just click the Always On tab.